Hi everyone, I'll be using um, the Revolution Mad Foundation and the Florence Foundation. The Revolution Foundation is way too light for me, so I'm gonna mix it with the Florence um, Tinted uh, Foundation, which is a little dark for me to match my skin. So I'm just uh, mixing it on the back of my hand. And I'm using a beauty blender that I got from a Dollar Tree, which is very, it's a latex free um, It's a latex free beauty blender, sponge or whatever you want to call it. So I'm just blending everything. Excuse me for my voice because my allergy is acting up. It's really way too mad. So if you have a moisturizer or anything to shear it off, go ahead because it's really, really mad. And I'll be using my um, Photo Focus um, loose powder. I was looking for a concealer, but I couldn't find it, so I decided to just use the one from Essence. And I still have to do a tutorial about that and the uh, new foundation from Essence. So on my next video, I might do that as well. It's very, very sheer. It doesn't have a coverage at all, but it's okay. It's not... If you have a dark under eye circle like me, it wouldn't be good, but, you know, it doesn't have coverage. So that's the photo focus powder. I'm just setting my makeup. I could go heavier if I wanted to, but um, that's not the main focus of this tutorial. It's all about the wet and wild collaboration with Sesame Street. So I'm focusing on that. I'm just doing the base and I'm using the eyebrow pencil that I got from uh, Amazon my son got it for me and you know what they say brow is life so I'm taking my time doing my brow you know in case you don't know I don't have a I'm not blessed with good brows but I don't want to do the what do you call that? Microblading. I don't want anything permanent. Because I do different looks, so I'm fine with my brow. I'm happy with it. It's fixable anyway, so. And I'm using my favorite wet and wild eyebrow kit. I'm just focusing on the tail part because um, that's where I don't have any hair. I'm uh, putting a darker shade at the tail of the brow. I could do better than that, but I was in a hurry, so yeah. It takes me forever to do my brow. Now I am using the Sesame Street 123 Sesame Street palette, also the Pampered palette by both Wet and Wild. Um, I'm both not a fan of them because after wearing it for only a few hours, it's just keep coming off it just wouldn't stay on my face at all and i never have any issue like that with any eyeshadow palette and i have to build it up to get pigmentation and it's not the best well i just got them for collection because i collect makeup but other than that um it's not worth it i'm sorry but I didn't really like it. 
it's not bad, like I said, but it's not the best. It's workable if you have a very, very patient, you know, personality. But if you're in a rush and you're in a hurry, this is not the palette for you. Because I'm trying to do a wearable makeup here. Bright, but wearable. I don't know which one keeps on coming off, but I don't know if the pampered or the or the Sesame Street palette, but something in that palette just made my eye watery unless my allergy is really acting up so bad. Or it's probably the the pink top that I'm gonna put there because it's uh, a little glittery. So anyway, I'm using that orange thing to put it on a, on my uh, crease to give it definition. And then I'm focusing on that uh, pink uh, shadow, lighter shadow. And then I'm using that one from Pampered. So that one was from Pampered was eventually, for not less, not even an hour, it's all over my face and it made my eyes so itchy. It looks pretty, but you know, it made my eyes so itchy. And then I'm using the Lime Crime uh, eyeliner. It's just brown. Because I don't want to do black too strong so I'm using that um, blush the let's play together blush it's called um, Perfect pair, it's Big Bird and Elmo. And then I'm gonna follow it using this uh, Let's Play Together bronzer. It's called um, Best Bodies, which is Ernie and Bert, or Bert and Ernie, whatever. Those two is fine, I, I'd rather have those than the eye palette. The mirror was on top of my my camera, that's why I was able to focus on applying my makeup instead of holding a mirror. I'm really happy about it, finally. Both of my hands are free. And I'm using that Essence Lashes. I like that one, the princess. I like the highlighter too. Wet and Wild makes the best highlighter. And I don't like that lipstick. It's called Gigo. It's Elmo there. And uh, I just don't like it. So I'm just going to shear it out by doing that. So anyway, I hope you like this look. This is um, the finished product. And I don't like it. I don't like it. It's fine. That one is fine. Well, the Florence is not. Anyway, see you guys. Bye. Love you. Hi, I just washed my face after I did the makeup look. And anyway, I went to 
um, CVS to get my medication and I went to Ulta to return the Florence foundation because it's, it smells bad I, I don't think it's a good foundation anyway my lips are swollen because um I was doing this the whole time I was fixing my um, blushes anyway this is the Florence shade that I got the new one um, I have the shade uh, LM070 earlier and now I change it to 60 because the 70 is too um, dark for me and anyway I went to CVS and got this uh, I already have this but I got another one better process this is the newest shade they have I think that's my third one or second one I'm not sure and then I, um, the Flower Beauty at CVS are all 30% off. So I got two of them. I already have this one shade in uh, Peach Prime Rose. And I got these two new shades. This one is in uh, Wild Rose and Berry. Berry more. Because <laughs> it's do Berry more, so it's Berry more. So anyway, that's the I got, it, that used to be um eleven fifty. Now I got it for uh, oh I also have the CVS uh, beauty cash reward or something, which is uh seven dollars. So I got each of this from eleven fifty to five oh five dollars. And this one for two fifty seven, so that's a good deal. So sometimes when you have coupon and you have a beauty reward card, um, um, cash reward, it's also good to buy a CBS. Anyway, thank you again for watching. I see you again next time, and I hope you like my makeup tutorial earlier. Bye.